Python can't thread across cores. The reason why dates back over 30 years to a fatally flawed assumption about the future of computer hardware. When language architects invented the global interpreter lock, it was created with the assumption that no Python app would ever run on a computer with more than one CPU. Moore's law said that computers would double in speed every two years. Python's multi-threading libraries assumed that computers of the future would have one single blazingly fast CPU. Threads would never actually run in parallel. Instead, threads would be scheduled serially on infinitely fast CPUs. The result would create the illusion of parallelism, but that's all it would be, an illusion. That's how Python was originally designed, and that's how Python works today. There are lots of projects that provide incompatible versions of Python that try to fix the problem, but the result isn't Python. The result is just a fragmented ecosystem of incompatible Python-esque libraries. Millions of dollars are being invested to try and fix the fragmentation, though. One attempt to stop the spread of new Python languages is another new Python language, named Mojo. Project Mojo promises to bring improved performance, multi-threading, and static typing to the world of Python. If everything works out, in 2026, Python devs will have everything that Java devs had in 1996. There's talk that Python itself might remove the gill. PEP 703 puts the gill on the chopping block. But it took Python 30 years to get a switch statement, so don't hold your breath over PEP 703. If you can't wait another decade to thread across cores, another option is to write multi-threaded applications in a more modern language, like Java or C Octothorpe. Then, just call the C Octothorpe code from your Python app. Or, you could write the whole thing in Java from the start. That would save you a lot of headaches. Oh, and if you're agile and working with Scrum, please check out my recently published Scrum Master Certification Guide. It's available on Amazon. Python and Java devs will love it.